a conversation about an important topic here in Iowa, around the country, sex trafficking. You usually think of the victims as being almost exclusively women. Remember, we had one of the victims on just a few days ago. But women are not the only victims here. KWW's Brad Hansen has talked to one man tonight. He's sharing his story in hopes that the male victims will not be overlooked. Kevin Klein and Dan Maurer are in eastern Iowa to share Klein's story. Klein was a victim of sex trafficking in St. Louis in 1975 and survived. Horrible things happened to me, and yet here I am. Klein kept his experiences to himself for more than 30 years. But after seeking treatment, he decided it was time to get his story out. There was a whole population of kids who were not being addressed, um, who were basically invisible. Klein started working with Maurer to write a book about his experience. The hope for me is that others might read this and would raise awareness that this happens to boys as well. Hopefully uh, men who had gone through this might read it and see that they're not alone. It's a story about friendship and it's a story about hope. That there's uh, hope for people who haven't found or heard that hope for so many years. There's one other reason why Klein wants others to hear his story. I held so much guilt and bore so much responsibility for what happened to me. And so realizing that this what happened then doesn't define me who I am now and, and that I can have uh, a real life because you know, it does a job on you. Uh, it messes with your head in just terrible ways. In Dubuque, Brad Hansen, KWW All News. Okay, Brad, thanks for the update here tonight. A lot more about Kevin Klein's book is in the web story right now on kww.com. By the way, this book can be pre-ordered online right now and will hit bookstores in May.